what's going on guys welcome to av atmos now i'm gonna do a quick review for you guys on uh, dark phoenix on blu-ray now if you're new subscribe now the tech specs for this movie goes in this form it is 113 minutes long um aspect ratio for this movie is 239 by one uh, you're getting full black bars um throughout this movie now uh, it was shot in 2.8k and 3.4k it has a 2k adi and uh, the sound mix for this one is dolby atmos on your standard 4k blu-ray disc and they are 7.1 um on um, your regular blu-ray now as so for visual effect this was one of uh, one of the standouts for this movie it was very very um, very good um, for the most part of it uh, this movie you, you you there is a lot of trash that happened throughout this movie the poor acting Sophia Turner wasn't so good as I expected her to be you could see that the entire casting was not really in for this movie um, and it showed the the the, the, the flow showed throughout the movie everything wasn't so crisp as it should have been but uh, nonetheless uh, the scenes were rendered well it's not um, as uh, as reference quality as uh, apocalypse was a few years ago you are getting very bright highlights in some many scenes but it uh, it's nothing so um, uh, big uh, especially if you're looking at uh, some of the very best um, picture quality out there it's it's something good but nothing really mind-boggling um, uh, it's, it's not something that um, you could compare to so many other Marvel movies in the mix now as for um, spectral highlights it was flashy it was vibrant sunlight come at you when it's needed uh, you get a, a very very strong um, sense of depth uh, throughout the movie the contrast was strong and uh, you get a very very well layered uh, movie all true and true um, I, I didn't get to see it in high dynamic range but for the most part this was really really solid you get very clean um facial reproduction on screen and you are getting a very very solid transfer the characters looked very good and you can see a lot of details uh in the movie now as for sound mix you are getting 7.1 on your regular uh, blu-ray and uh adobe atmos track on the disc now this was a bit light in the surrounds and uh, you are getting more immersion more um, especially when the action scenes come into play it's quite good it's not reference quality the base was solid the mids were very very tight and punchy um, you're getting very dynamic outbursts whenever the action starts um, happening in some scenes it's not um, there like other um, movies in DC like Godzilla or um, Avengers Endgame or the movies like John Wick uh, but it's quite good good for what it is as for audio i'm gonna give it a 7.5 out of 10 for the 7.1 mix uh maybe the atmos mix will be a lot more better but as for visuals i'm gonna give it an 8 over 10 it was quite good and uh, i really expect more from the mcu now coming uh forward considering they have it and uh, subscribe to our channel if you like this content and follow us on social media i'll come to you guys with next review